sports. It's in the game.
Hi everybody, welcome to you all. Martin Tyler here along with Alan Smith. Uh, Alan's been assessing the conditions. Uh, it's raining. Is that going to help the attackers, do you think? Well, it normally does. It tends to lead to one or two mistakes from defenders. I looked at the forecast beforehand. I don't think this rain's going to let up. What's this game going to bring us? We'll find out very shortly now, won't we? Because the game is underway. And this is today's starting lineup for the home team. The system that we think they're going to go with is 4 5 1. That one striker will need a bit of support. Yeah, you do not want him to be left isolated. Otherwise, this formation will not work. And this is how the manager of the visiting team wants to go today. He's starting 11. Well, we think, Alan, it'll be a 4-5-1 formation, which can look a bit negative. Yeah, but you look at the players in that five, that midfield five, and I think a couple at least will be trying to support the lone frontman. Jonathan Petroipa. Well, the home team have a problem. They can't get goals, and actually, in the division itself, they are the lowest scorers. Well, you can blame the forwards, but, you know, the service to them has been shocking at times. Really getting at the opposition this far up the pitch now. now. That's safely away. And this is going to be a throw. And another throw. Toure. And they're looking good when they get the ball out wide, as they've done here. Jonathan Petroipa. Going forward well. Got to be. Oh, it's a brilliant goal. And it was worth the wait. He's taken the chance very stylishly indeed. And it's given them advantage at last. They've worked hard to get it. And goodness me, they're celebrating it. Oh, and his teammates are delighted. And why not? Because... He's just kept his composure outside the box to sideward home. He's not the easiest of managers to work for, I know that, but his players are doing what he demanded beforehand now. And that has opened the scoring, 1-0 here. Toure. Rushing it here, moving from one side to the other. Put away, but not out of harm's way. Being closed down. Jonathan Petroipa. And now the shot! And they have scored! And they do lead now by two. And they've worked very hard for this. It should get them across the line at the end of the match, we'll see. Very much quick-fire football from these boys. They've scored again. Different angle on it here. Restarting at 2-0. Out into the wide areas now. It's with Toure. Now he can cross it. Looking for teammates in the middle. Well, it's out for a corner. In goes the corner. Great contact with the header. Great work from the keeper. He's cut that out well, well read. Definitely a throw in there. 
never quite as simple as you think to throw the ball to one of your teammates. I think uh, any football fan will say, when the rain comes down like it's coming down now, it's going to add to the thrills, a few spills possibly. Well, it normally does, doesn't it? And I always used to like it because uh, it quite often meant you got a few more chances in the box with the uh, bounce of the ball and what have you. Jonathan Petroipa read that well with the interception. Done well under pressure here to hold the ball as the challenge came in. Keeper able to stop that one. Well, the signal's gone up for two minutes. That's a great interception. Half time now, and 2 0 is this. What's this game going to be? So it is time now for the start of the second half. Saw it coming, cut it out, good work. Conte. Well, they are in the lead and they are on the ball, but in their own half at the moment. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. Petroipa, goalkeeper out of position, and from close range, he really should have scored. Well, he should. That was a golden opportunity, Spurred. Hey. It's with Toure. That's his game, isn't it? Intercepting. with Toure. Poor attempt at a pass, really. And they've got a man out wide. Well, we're two-thirds of the way through the 90 minutes. Half an hour to go. Trying to find a way through here, probing away. Some players limbering up for the away team, substitution in the offing. He's aimed for the far post here. And it's in! Perfect header! Great power with the header, excellently placed, fine goal. Oh, it's fantastic timing, he gets up early. And what an emphatic finish. Off we go again, 2-1. Substitute coming up for the away team. They're looking for a hero here, this team. It's time for the Alamo, by the looks of it. They need a goal and they're piling everybody forward. It's with Toure. On the move and able to cut out the pass. And goalkeeper slams it upfield. Takes on the shot! That's great work by the goalkeeper. They spread it out wide here. Chance to get some width into this attack. We've got 10 minutes left on the clock. Oh, his teammates will thank him for that. 
Can they hang on to this one goal lead? The fans are trying to play their part in it happening. Yeah, and it's the approach that the home team take that will be important. Do you go on and push for another or just try and hold what you have? Toure. Jonathan Petroipa. Toure. It's a very good interception. We've got two added minutes. That's been signaled now. Let's fly! Decent effort there. And they still have this lead, but it could have been widened. Just wonder whether that might be a turning point and whether it might give the opposition the confidence to come back at this side. Jonathan Petroipa. Well, they could have been opened up there. And that is the end. It's all over. Well, winning is a wonderful feeling, but particularly when you've beaten a team as good as this one, and they are very proud, and rightly so. I think so. They would have come into the game not quite knowing what to expect, but having put together... We should have a fine game for you today. I'm Martin Tyler. Alan Smith is with me. Welcome to you all. It's just a matter of time which game will confirm the title for them. They've led from start to very near the finish. Oh, what a team we've witnessed this season. A, a talented one and also one that's full of experience and concentration. That's been the word that's... Uh, been at the forefront to maintain this huge gap. The lineup for the home side. The system that we think they're going to go with is 4 5 1. That one striker will need a bit of support. Yeah, you do not want him to be left isolated, otherwise, this formation will not work. Have a look now at the lineup for the visiting team. 
And a look at the opposing side as well. It's pretty similar, Alan, isn't it? It is. I hope we're not in, uh, in for a snore fest here when there's not going to be many chances at either end. Toure. Trying a bit too hard, trying to force the pass, and it went uh, straight to an opponent. Striding forward, purposefully. Must take the lead here, which they do in good style. Uh, they played some good football leading up to that, Martin, and thoroughly deserved that goal. Well, you get a lot of satisfaction as a goal scoring forward for knocking one in from that distance. You know you're in the right place. No, it was a poacher's effort. The final finish wasn't difficult, but to get there, that took a little bit of instinct. So the first goal, it's 1-0. Fuchs. Looking for an opening with some good control build-up. Fuchs. Toure. I think he saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going and read it. Conte. Toure. They blocked it then. Possession is the shot on. The ball's loose. Goalkeeper made the save, but he couldn't hold it. Well, if that had gone in just a second ago, I think that would have been game over. The keeper's kept them in it. Here's a chance to just stretch the opposition with a bit of width. Jonathan Petroipa. It's with Toure. Taking on the defenders. Has to score. Offside. The officials clearly in agreement. And that's a straightforward offside decision. On the attack here. Can really get at the opposition here. A shot and well, that's gone behind for a corner corners taken it's not really away poor clearance well, the signal's gone up for two minutes cut out the pass well, that's half time at one nil Well, the player that we're featuring here has done well. He's certainly been an influence on this first half. Well, he played really well, didn't he? And he got himself a goal to put his team ahead. He'll be pleased with that first 45 minutes.
just a matter of time which game will confirm the title for them they've led from start to very near the finish striding forward purposefully must take them and they kick off at the start of the second half Toure. Fuchs. Moving forward with some danger to the opposition. Now they're here. Oh, he spotted the pass and cut it out. It's with Toure. The driver! Room for the cross. Punched away by the keeper. Oh, what a fine goal. They lead by two now. They'll feel a little bit more comfortable. And they're good value for this advantage at the moment. One more look at what happened earlier. Could the defender have done anything different, Alan? Well, maybe he's half turned away, and that didn't help. If he'd have closed it down a bit more bravely, it might have been better. Restarting at 2 0. Well, the game can be influenced so often by substitutes. The home team are going to perhaps gamble on that working for them now. Well, there's still time to hit back in this game, and they're going to try and do it with a substitute. Just a case of finding the spare man is always available in their own half and the opposition letting them do this at the moment, although they are trailing. Jonathan Petroipa. No wonder these fans are upset. Their team can't get hold of the ball. No chance, no sign at the moment of trouble in the opposition's goal. A lot of defenders between them and the goal, but they still got the ball. It's with Toure. And that will be a throw. Jonathan Petroipa. Tried to tackle here, and he's done that. Awusu. Fuchs. Just over a quarter of an hour left on my watch. Fuchs. They're looking to make the change now as quickly as possible, the home team. Careless there. Throw in to come. Well, this is the time where the managers really earn their money. It's going to be an alteration to try and improve the team. Fuchs. And on the clock, eight more minutes. We've got the away manager indicating he wants to make a substitution now. Could whip it in from here. Whipped in from the wide area. Oh, well done, the goalkeeper. And he's hung on to the ball.
Well, only two more minutes to be added on by the referee now. Blocked off the pass there. It's over, and the referee blows the whistle for the last time. Hard fought, this win. Two very evenly matched teams. Yeah, sometimes it feels even better than if you were to win 3 or 4 nil. Well, he's had a very good game, hasn't he? It's just a matter of time. Welcome everybody, Alan Smith alongside me, Martin Tyler, nice to have you along for the ride. Well, here is the team sheet for the home side. Well, we think, Alan, it'll be a 4-5-1 formation, which can look a bit negative. Yeah, but you look at the players in that five, that midfield five, and I think a couple at least will be trying to support the lone front man. Really trying to use the full width of the pitch here to make some progress. That's good vision to be able to switch the play there. Excellent work with the tackle. Slipping it through. Brilliant pass, can he finish it? Men in the middle frustrated because that cross has gone straight behind. What we've got here is a chance for the home team to do the double over their opponents today, Alan. Yeah, they made a statement, Martin, didn't they, with that earlier win on away territory, and it was a really good performance. It's a free kick, and that's all it is. The referee is keeping his cards in his pocket. Uh, cut out by the defender. Guiding the pass through. I think the wide man's got a chance here. There's space out near the touchline. And it's going to be his throw here. Toure. Still got a bit to do, but this is promising. 
He's got support here. And here's the shot. And there it is, the opening goal. One more look at what happened earlier. Could the defender have done anything different, Alan? Well, maybe he's half turned away, and that didn't help. If he'd have closed it down a bit more bravely, it might have been better. And that has opened the scoring, 1-0 here. Well, there's a chance playing at home to extend this run of two consecutive victories into three. Yeah, and the way they've played in those previous two, I, I can see them making it three as well. Couldn't keep it. A bit predictable with the passing and the opposition able to deal with that. Looking to use the full width of the pitch in this attack. He's got his shot off now. It's in. Fine moment for them. They've got a firmer grip on the game now. They're two ahead. Well, he's doubled up here with his second goal. And he took it in excellent style, just like the first one. Well, they want to see this again, this goal. Well, I know this manager's been working hard on the training ground on a certain shape, and boy, is it getting results out there. Restarting at 2-0. Attacking now. Oh, good idea, I suppose, but it didn't work, so maybe not such a good idea. Well, they are in the lead, and they are on the ball, but in their own half at the moment. Here's a chance to go down the outside of the opposition. Jonathan... Petroipa. The shot's on. Really stretched to make the save. Top class. It will be a corner. Corner played into the middle. Only partially clear. Shots on here. And that'll be a corner. In goes the corner. It's under hit the corner. And the man at the front post gets it away. Shots on. Keeper controls it. Never looked like bouncing off him. Yeah, it made it look easy, but his positioning did that for him. Got to pass the ball a bit better than this if they're going to make progress, giving it straight away. Looking for teammates in the middle. He can only put it behind for the corner. Gone short with the corner. Well, then it goes. Good block, but a poor cross. Well, the team with the ball have got a problem now because the opposition are just sitting behind the ball and letting them pass in front they've got to find some attacking players with some penetration in their passing and shoots good block trying to pick out someone in the center and that's really the way to get the ball out of the danger zone well that's half time and 2-0 with the score at the halfway mark well, what a player. What a performance in that first half, Alan. On top of his game out there, and I'm sure he'll be thinking about grabbing his hat-trick in the second half.
And they kick off at the start of the second half. Prepared to just pass the ball around in their own half. Winning the game as the scoreline tells you. Trying to find a way through here, probing away. He works so hard on his heading, he needs to do a bit more work, I think. Yeah, the keeper's waving that one bye-bye. That's a good spot by the defender. We've got the away manager indicating he wants to make a substitution now. Good vision. Brilliant pass, can he finish it? Cleared away, well away from goal. And now the shot! Bounce back off the post. Well, that'll be a throw. Well, this is interesting, whether the manager is just going to switch things around a little bit. deal with it here safety first there to right Jonathan Petroipa the shot's on very very close just past the post well, I think half the crowd you know thought that was going to nestle in the corner of the net there Jonathan Petroipa, and a special occasion for him, concentrating there on the match on his birthday. Well, that's a good clean tackle to stop the attack. Pleasing on the eye, and no great risk at the moment in their own half. And they are winning the match, of course. One or two players are warming up for the home team. We'll see who comes on. Lemoyne. 20 minutes of the 90 still to play. Well, down on the touchline, getting uh, the details about that injury is Jeff Shreves. Jeff. He landed really awkwardly on his shoulder there and he's in some discomfort. But he's a tough cookie. I think he'll stay out there. Well, and here's the shot. And that's a, a save for the goalkeeper. And they've spread it out wide here. He's cut it out. We've got 10 minutes left on the clock. And there was danger, but he's cleared it. Good interception there. Striding forward, purposefully. Put into the middle. Jonathan Petroipa. Here's a chance to go down the outside of the opposition. The score! That's a brilliant stop. And it's out for a corner. And now he's going to sort out that earlier incident and book the player who committed the foul. Yeah, he doesn't miss much, this ref. He's, he's eagle-eyed and uh, he wanted to give the team a chance to move forward, but always oh, going to produce the yellow for that. And we're going to get substitutions from both managers. 
Corner swung in. And they get it away. Jonathan Petroipa. Very skilled. These passes may look easy, but the uh, work off the ball. A real miscue here. Well, the game has run its course here, and there's the final whistle. Just looking down, the manager's got a smile as wide as the pitch because it's been a near-perfect day for him and his team. Yeah, definitely. Clean sheets and uh, one or two goals into the bargain, so they can move on with confidence.